not. You must be kidding. Hey guys, welcome back to RetroSidal's Game Channel. This is RetroSidal. I found this uh, cool little Vista Cruiser. I think it's like a 64, 67, or the 70s. I'll have the right year posted. I kind of just started the video and just kind of did a brain fart. So yeah, so much for the... Uh... But anyway, it's got ELS, so it's kind of cool. It's an older model, so I'm kind of lucky that it works in the game. Uh, some of the models don't work, so hopefully enjoy this kind of odd looking car. I think it's kind of neat looking, you know, it's not realistic, I don't think. But anyways, I'm going to use it because it's old school, and yeah. I'm going to turn on my dispatcher here. Oh, and we got somebody driving a little crazy already here. Pull over to the side of the road! Pull over the sold. What is this? A Ford or Chevy? Chevy? Oopsie. Wrong button. I've been playing so many damn games lately that I can't uh, figure out my buttons anymore. Too many games between Arma and then LCPDFR and uh, Arma 2 and 3 are different so that really confuses me and then LCPDFR buttons all over the place. And then we got Borderlands. The buttons are all different. Well ma'am, you've been driving aggressively and you're Badass fucking you were all over the road. badass uh, truck here. So I need to see your ID, ma'am. Thank you. Bullshit. It's not bullshit. Thanks. I'm gonna call this into dispatch on the radio. Since we're doing old school, I'm mostly go on radio instead of computers, so we'll just be doing a lot of radio stuff mostly. You can go around, Dick Face. Go around in that cool ass car. I like all these old cars, they're so cool. Alright, well, uh, Think I should give her a warning or not? Hmm. It's a pretty nice truck, so I'm gonna give her a warning, I guess. <laughs> All right, ma'am, we'll try to slow down because you're gonna wreck your really hot, your really cool-looking truck here. So. You're okay. On your way, please. I'll have Derek by <laughs> No, you don't have to pull over for code 3. I gotta figure out what that setting is. It's an ELS setting that you can just set, so... Uh, just to check it out, I wanna... So if people don't pull over, I guess it's okay. I, it, you can use it to your advantage, and then also sometimes when you throw on code 3, then everybody just kinda gets off the road here. Oh, wow. Alright, we got something right here, so we're gonna have to back this up here. This is Control, civilians report a reckless driver in Middle Park West. I'm gonna go ahead and report to the, to the reckless driver instead. Just cause the reckless driver might endanger some lives and that person's not moving, so... Pull over! This is the police! <laughs> Come on, go Vista Cruiser! Go, go, go! It's kind of like, uh, handles look like a little different, it's a little slower for some reason. Ooh, baby! He's airborne! <laughs> Get out of the car. Pull over or we will use force! Let's see if I can smash him. No, you can. Damn it. Get out of the car, man. Let's see if we can get him smashed up against him. Okay, we got him. Yeah, we got him, we got him, we got him. Maybe it's kick, close down traffic here. Get out of the fucking car, dude. I'm gonna blast your ass. Get out of the fucking car. One. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Put your hands up right now. Ah, oh, it's a fucking drunk bastard. I, I would check. I'm not gonna. I can't check him. He's too jack. He's too drunk. So he just keeps falling over and I can't get the option and I'll screw my game up. So we're just going to try and arrest him here as soon as he stands up here. This is what I'm talking about. I don't know why. It's kind of cool that he's drunk and stuff. And I guess that I'm struggling to get him under arrest. I mean, I'm not going to complain. It's kind of cool, but uh, to search him is almost uh, impossible. We're going to take him down to the station because we got a big old car. So big old boat here. All right, sir, sit in the back of the car. I'm going to get this situation cleared up here. Everybody needs to stop and uh, let's call this into dispatch. I can get some more ammo for my shotgun here and five fucking bullets ain't gonna cut it. 
Ain't gonna cut it. Okay, let's go ahead and get his car uh, searched really quick and stuff. Pretty nice car, actually. Okay, let's tow it off. Hello, hello. Hey, tow truck driver, thank you. Oh, he's freaking out now. That means he's gonna try and jump out of the car when he does that crap. Shut up, man. Fucking A. And they go across here. I'm going up the wrong road here. I hate when they scream like this. I don't understand what causes that. It's like a little glitch, but it's not real bad. But I mean, you know, it's not the best either. Let's take this guy down to jail. One thing I do want to talk about is like <laughs> once I get this guy to jail, because he's just screaming too much. Is about oh oh, I finally kind of like was thinking. I was like, wonder why like I like YouTube so much. Like, what is it that it's in my head that's kind of like it's like in my head. It's not about like making the videos or being like trying to be you know heard or whatever it's just about mostly well it is nice to be heard by people and know that people are watching you play a game and stuff it's pretty cool but it's mostly about back in the old days when we used to go to arcades when I was younger um, I used to actually work out a few arcades and um, also used to um, let's get on the highway here we'll go on the highway since it's kind of a highway car anyways get out of the city um, I used to work at a couple of arcades but anyways when I was young you know we used to always play Everybody's driving like an idiot. We used to play a lot of arcade games like Street Fighter, Mortal Kombat, um, what else? Just old school fighter games and uh, and stuff like that. So, anyways, we used to get we used to be pretty good at it. And uh, what the hell's going on up here? And so, uh, when we used to play, we would just uh, you know sometimes people would watch us and then uh, like we play like Street Fighter and people would like gather around our arcade machine and watch us and like at some point we had like young people and old people watching us I mean it was a pretty good crowd especially when Mortal Kombat rolled around not so much Street Fighters people would still gather around but when Mortal Kombat 1 came out and we were I mean we were practicing we could do you know <coughs> excuse me I'm trying to take a little drink <coughs> a, a lot of different things I'm gonna have to pull this guy over I don't know what the hell this guy's doing here this is the LCPD pull over now <laughs> Damn it, sorry, I just, I knew I was going to do that, screw up and start choking and making noise, I hate that. Anyways, <laughs> let me just choke some more, gosh damn it. So we'd get gather people to gather around us and like, um, watch us play, and I you know we did that for quite a long time, I wound up working at, uh, that same mall that we uh, used to play arcade games at, I wound, I wound up working there for a few years, and then, um, Sooner or later, me and you gonna have it out. So, anyways, it was nice to have those people gather Let's around and just kind of watch us play, and you know, some people would get into it, and we'd have our own little tournaments, and everybody nice. put their little quarter up there in line, you know, and we wait in line to play because people there were so many people wanting to play and try to like beat. Like my, one of my friends was really good at it, and uh, he's I guess said of everybody that when we were young he was kind of good at stuff, like more better at like like sports and stuff like that but then he's not really the like the smartest dude when it comes to like decisions <laughs> like pretty good like I mean let's just say that you know I yeah his decisions are pretty bad compared to mine but he was good at other things I guess all right I'm just gonna ask this guy it's gonna give you him a, a warning I guess because uh, stay out of trouble I don't know what else to do. He's, dude, what is he doing again? He's stopping in the middle of the road again for. What does he keep doing that for? Okay, well, he's finally going. Jeez, I was gonna pull him over again if he didn't freaking. He just kept stopping in the middle of the road for no reason, so that's whatever. Let's see if we can get back to the highway. Ooh, don't go. Ah, damn, I was hoping I didn't hit that if I would have started the mission. I wonder if I had installed anything yet. No, no. Oh, yeah, I did. Okay. I got a speedometer reader. Oh man, we've got a speeder for sure. <laughs> oh, she knew, I guess. To the side of the road. She fucking pulled over right away, that's for sure. So we got this speeder, but you know, it was really enjoyable just to have all those people gather around. It was, everybody was kind of cool with each other. Once in a while, people would talk shit and stuff like that. But you know, it was kind of like a male thing, you know, a bunch of guys together. But we pretty much had a good time. Nobody really got in a fight or anything, just a little bit of shit talking. It was fun. I wound up working at the arcade for a few years. 
talking to some pretty girls because it was at the mall. And um, I enjoyed crazy. myself, but then also, the yeah, the girls I liked, I don't know. There's so many men out here that it's kind of hard Show me some for guys like me that are a little more uh -huh. average to actually get girls. Anyways, like, we were only, like, you know, like, yes, what, yes. like, 16 or 15. And um, when I was working there, she would, you know, this pretty girl would come visit me all the time and talk to me. And I told her I liked her a lot and stuff. And she knew I liked her. And then, like, sometimes she'd come back and, like, be, be like, a bunch of old dudes with her. It was like, what the fuck? Like, 21, 25-year-old dudes in the Army and the Air Force. And that's why I don't have a whole lot of respect for them because I just, um, ever since I was in junior high, I live in Colorado Springs. It's an Army town. And uh, they were always, you know... Um, they were always, uh, I'm going to give her a good ticket for speeding 60 bucks. Anyway, so they were always getting my little girlfriends and taking them and, and, you know, doing stuff with them. I don't know. I didn't appreciate it too much. I thought it was wrong, so, that they did that to them. Thanks, and drive even safety. though, you know, the girls, I guess, they, they think yeah, they're cool because, you know, they're really skinny and they got six packs and they got cars and they got money to spend and stuff like that. But it's still, they were too, you know, they were just too young for them, you know. I don't wow, understand. Oh, sorry. sorry, 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 sorry. I'm trying to get out of the road here. But anyways, so I lost quite a few girls that I liked because of that. Uh, kind of breaks your heart, you know, when you're that young and then some old dude takes your young girlfriend from you. But anyways, we'll get past that. It was fun, but then I guess that was the down point of it there. That, you know, the girls that I did meet were kind of taken from me. Were taken from me, so it kind of sucks. But back to the just getting the group of people. Uh, where the hell's the guy with the warrant at? Damn it! I don't know if I'm gonna catch up to this guy with the warrant or not. I don't think so. Uh, anyways, it was pretty fun though. Most of the time, other than that, we would have a lot of fun. I'd give my friends uh, a lot of free, a lot of free uh, credits on the like machines and stuff. And actually, that's how I lost my job. Is I would it was by that by that time. I respond to that drug deal, but by the time I was giving them free tokens, it was they weren't. It's not like I wasn't giving them money. You know, it was not like I was, here's a bunch of money out of the fucking drawers. I was just giving them free tokens because you had to buy tokens. And we'd have like spare tokens, you know, to give people for when like the games jam or whatever. So now I'd give them a few extra tokens and just it was nothing really that bad. And then, like, I found out that one of my managers wound up, he was embezzling money out of the company and, like, ripped them off for, like, $50,000. And I was like, dude, all I was doing was just giving out a couple of tokens and then you're going to fire me when this fucking manager guy's... Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. All right, I'll, I'll come back and then need news. This guy's a fucking lunatic! We need heavy-ass artillery down here! Let's get out. I'm trying to stop now. Put your hands up, put your hands up, put your hands up. Hands up, hands up. Oh shit! God damn, it hit me, hit me. Officer hit, officer hit, officer hit, officer hit. Let's get this fucker. Metal deal with that. We're gonna go after the uh, second suspect that's been ramming people around me. Oh shit! Alright, we'll do something. Hold on, we'll shoot your tires up! Oh crap, this old car is not that fast. Go car, go, 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 go! Come on, you can do it, you can do it. Oh, he's coming back this way. This car is really big, it's not as fast. Oh my god, there goes that van like crazy. Holy crap. Trying to catch up to the suspect, sorry, this car is hard to drive. Trying to, uh, trying to stay with him. Just gotta keep going, we'll be alright. Hey, I got my uh, emergency lights uh, siren second going, so the other cops got normal sirens. Okay, we're catching up slowly here. I knew that was gonna happen. Damn it! They didn't flip me. They didn't flip me. At least 
Lisa didn't flip me. We got a good chase going, guys. Come on, guys. Turn, turn. Please, please turn, turn, turn. Straight. We're gonna try and cut him off at one of these roads. He's taking straight still. Holy shit, this is a good chase. Please don't crash, game. Please don't crash. Here we go, we're catching up with him. Shit, suspect, suspect vehicle, there was another one back there. Damn it, I'm having a hard time capping, keeping up with him. Gosh dang it. I think we finally got the suspect, we finally got the suspect. Good, good pit. Oh shit. Close him in, close him in. Shotgun out, get the shotgun, get, get, get out of there. Get in, get in, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Go, 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 go. This guy's gotta be hurt. He's gotta be hit a little bit. Turn car, this car. Oh, we got a roadblock set up. Did they stop him or no? Nope. Calling ass again. Holy crap. Oh, god damn it. No, no, no. Please crash and wreck. Please crash. We're almost gonna lose him. No, don't lose him. Don't lose him. Come on, come on. Come on, you little shitty car. Go, go, shitty car. Oh, shit. He's stuck on something. He's stuck on something. He's stuck on something. He's stuck on something. Come on. Oh, I remember these things are hard to stop because, like, they're, they're, uh, I'm gonna shoot this stuff. Wow. They're like fucking tanks. I forgot about that. They're like tanks for some reason. I don't know why, but whatever slot they put them on, they're like, like, so strong and fast. It's like amazing. Look at it. It's already gone again. Most freaking the fastest vehicle in the game is this right now. Man, this thing is so hard to turn. But I, I like that you guys are watching me play, and it reminds me of being a kid again. So I really appreciate it, brother. You guys have ever realized that. And thanks for the. People that the new people that have started to watch me, thank you. You know, those little bit of extra subs and stuff keep me going. And like, sometimes I have bad days, and I wake up and I see that there's another person that subscribed, and it actually means a lot to me. So, now let's catch this asshole. No, we didn't even do nothing. Okay, there we go. I think we got him. We got him. We got him on the side. Get the fuck out of the car, you little motherfucker. Put your fucking hands up. You're about oh shit, you got the AK-47. Suspect's got an AK-47. Suspect is down. Suspect is down. I repeat. Suspect is down. Hmm. Wow, he pulled out an AK-47. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and uh, let the uh, close this down for a second while the mech clears him and searches his vehicle. Damn, was this guy not even on? He wasn't even on cocaine or nothing, huh? Picked up the AK, so now I got an AK. Let's go ahead and have it towed. Ah, okay. We're gonna have to move it off the side of the road. This is models glitch. It always did this to me before. It says that there's um, somebody in it, but there's not. Holy crap! It's got a lot of power. Just barely tap the gas and it's like gone. No wonder we had such a hard time catching it. Anyways, we'll just uh, have the tow trucks come up later. Yeah, everybody can go ahead and move now. I'm gonna go ahead and just go around the side here. I'm not gonna bother trying to, yeah, deal with them guys. Holy crap. Let's just take a second to see the damage to the vehicle, okay? 
Let's just take a damage look real quick here, and then I'll repair it. Good thing this thing was kind of tough, or I'm surprised I stayed with him. I thought I was going to blow up a couple times, but yeah, it's pretty fucked up. The whole back wheel is just completely bent in. Just completely bent in. I thought I was going, thought I felt like I was going a little slower too. I wonder if that was why. I think it does affect the driving a tad, so. Well, pretty good. At least I got my lights still, my top lights. Let's go ahead and repair this thing. Clean and repair it. Clean and fix. I think I'll put my uh, police hopper back in and see how the game runs. And if it works fine, then we'll go ahead and uh, I'll go ahead and use that. Yeah, we'll just go ahead and clear that, get out of the area. So you know, because it's just kind of screwed up the traffic now. So let's just get back to our, our area here. I was wondering why my cop hasn't turned his headlights on yet. It's starting to get uh, a little bit dark. So hopefully, guys, I'm just going to keep going and going and trying my hardest and improving myself. And maybe wish me luck that one of these days I find a nice girl. I think that would really help me out a lot in my life. And it seems like every time I ever had a girlfriend, like everything like started going better than when I didn't. Like As far as everything, like money, oh shoot, I'm not thinking I went the wrong way, this goes under the bridge, and like money, stuff like that, there goes my headlights, right on, right on, right on, man, since we're back in the old days, we'll talk like that, right on, dude, so I think that would help me, like, increase, like, my, make me feel better about myself, well, yeah, girls make you feel better about yourself, and then, you know, it's nice to have somebody, like, to watch a movie with, or, you know, hang out with, it'd be nice to meet a girl that likes to play games a little bit with, Stuff like that. So that's another reason I really haven't found anybody. I can't find anybody that doesn't smoke about 25,000 cigarettes a day. I can't meet anybody that wants to play video games and not smoke cigarettes and hang out with me at the same time. So, I don't know. Uh, meeting girls that like games is pretty hard sometimes because it's not... Most girls don't want to have nothing to do with games. They'd rather be out looking for dudes or whatever have you. I don't know. Uh, I'll just go ahead and check the smugging out. Anyways... I'll just keep uh, on patrol here. We don't got to worry about that. But maybe if I ever did find a nice girl, I think it could really... Oh, disregard. See, look, I'm thinking about girls so much that it said disregard. And it took me like a minute to figure it out. And I think it could make my personality come out more. Because some days, you know, I kind of kind of bummed out. You know, nobody to hang out with. It's, the last couple girlfriends I had, we, I mean, we were, I was together with them for a while. And it didn't work out. But it's just having somebody around, you know, the... Somebody take you down the street, or maybe you're not feeling good, or you know, to be around, or something like that. So, yeah, some days it's just hard for me to make videos. So, if I ever sound a little bummed out and stuff, or maybe I'm a little angry one day or something, sometimes it has a lot to play, do with it. So, anyways, just for wishful hoping that we can get, uh, I can someday meet a nice girl. It would be awesome. So awesome. So very awesome. But she's have to be understanding a little bit because. All right, we're gonna go ahead and pull this guy over then. Cause uh, yeah, I'm a little Pull different, over. so you can't tell. I'm a tad different a little bit. So like girls don't really like different. They just kind of want those same dudes they see on TV that look like, you know, Disney characters or whatever. So since I don't look like a Disney character, you know, it makes it a little hard. Okay, let's check this guy out. If I can get that sign to pop up here. Yo, I'm supposed to be getting brains off this girl, come on! There we go. You guys can go around, you know that? We'll just go on the other side. These guys are being stupid. Where you been? Well, I put the year of the car in there. I don't even know where I got it from. I was just searching the internet for anything I could find old school that had ELS compatibility and Yo, would work. What's going on? So, uh, what did he have again? Sooner or later, me and you Warrant? gonna have it out. Can't remember now. Gosh, dang it. Let's see some ID. Okay. Let's check his ID. Thanks. I I could have sworn I disabled my picture thing. But yet, it likes to take pictures anyways. You know, you guys can go around, right? He has no warrants, but the a that thing pops up on him. His license is valid. 
Um, alright, well, I don't know. It must be some kind of error, so we're gonna let him go. You're okay. On your way, please. He stopped, and he doesn't have no warrants, so... See, it says he's wanted, but he's not, so... Oh, that's the wanted guy. Oh, my God. Whoopsie. He's the one with the warrant, not the fucking motorcycle. Damn. Sorry, dude, in the motorcycle. I didn't mean to pull you over. <laughs> uh, see what happens when you think about girls. You fuck up everything. This is the LCPD. Pull over now. Give him a chance to pull over before I go code three here. Code three, though, since he's wanted, so... Back up. We got a couple officers in the, in the vicinity here. We're gonna go ahead and ask the guy to step out of his vehicle. Okay, okay, he's running. All right. Oh, damn it. Oh, bus. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing. This car makes the chases pretty fucking interesting. Fun. I like it. Uh, I'll probably set the. E I think I don't have the ELS set up right on this car, but it still looks all right. So screw it. Whatever. I'm not perfectionist, you know, I can't spell perfect, I can't do any perfect, I'm odd, I'm different, I can't, you know, I'm not perfect, so, don't ever try to claim to be perfect, some people are like, you gotta be perfect at everything, well then, go watch perfect people, please, sorry, if I can't talk good enough for you, or I can't spell good enough for you, or whatever, then I'm sorry, then I guess I'm just not, you know, what you want to watch, you can watch somebody else, I just had somebody give me a hard time about it, so I just kind of kiss, like, well, who cares, you know? Everybody's running, running, running. Nope, no inside view. Probably put the first person view in next episode. And then slowly add things every episode and different cars. So, ah, oh, fucking turns, fuck me over. Every time, man. The little car takes a sharp turn and I'm like, ah, oh, my brake doesn't work very good. Alright, I think this will be our last uh, chase of the night. So, that's good. At least it's gonna be a good episode, guys. Hope you enjoy the old school cars and me and my uh, commenting on different things like from why I like YouTube to about, you know, needing a girlfriend, I don't know, just kind of... Oh, 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 man, man, he's down. You're done? You're done. You're done. You're done, son. Get out of the car. You're done. Get out of the vehicle. Oh, I'll use this guy's AK-47. Get out of the vehicle. Get out of the vehicle, now! Put your fucking hands up, son! Nope, I'm taking him in, you damn it. Get the fuck away from him. Oh my god, you're not gonna let me arrest him? Or what the fuck, man? No, shit. Alright, whatever. Fucking law. <laughs>